Today marked the 100th transplant this year for the blood and bone marrow transplant program at SSM Health St. Louis University Hospital. All new tonight, Fox 2's Katherine Hessel has reaction from the director of the program and a woman receiving a transplant about the medical milestone. In 2007, Jean Johnson was diagnosed with acute myeloid leukemia. She underwent a stem cell transplant and was cancer free for 12 years until this year. In the beginning of this year, about February, um, a sarcoma came back on the, my spine, on my L5, and um, it was the, the AML again, and in my spinal fluid. Jan has been going through chemo and radiation, and Thursday she got her second stem cell transplant. Because of COVID, family couldn't be by her side this time, but they did make sure to get in a FaceTime before the transplant. That's the worst part. I mean, everybody that is up here is great, but that's the worst part. Yeah, because you get real lonesome and you like to have your family around. Dr. Mark Fessler is the director of the bone marrow transplant program at SSM St. Louis University Hospital. He says the number of treatments they have for blood cancers has grown exponentially in the past few years, and it's leading to more transplants and better outcomes. Since about 2012, we've seen incremental increase, not only in the number of patients that we're transplanting, but at the same time, we're seeing gains in the one year survival. Fessler says with everything else going on in 2020, they weren't necessarily trying to break any of their own transplant records. We have to be very um, protective of them when it comes to getting exposed to COVID. And so we didn't, we didn't really imagine doing this number of transplants this year. But they're happy that they've been able to maintain their commitment to taking care of their blood cancer patients during the pandemic. He hopes this transplant will put Jan's cancer back into a long-term remission. And he says he's thankful to the village that it takes to treat patients like Jan and hit this milestone. It's been a, a, a busy year, but I think a really productive one. Reporting, I'm Katherine Hessel.